Are you thinking of buying a brand new home in Wake Forest, North Carolina, but you don't want to break the bank? Or are you thinking of renting, but you'd much rather get a place of your own for about the same amount as rent? Well, you've come to the right place because we're going to explore the top three affordable new townhome communities in Wake Forest, and we're getting started right now. guys, I'm Mike Sanders with the Mike Sanders team at Remax United. I'm a local real estate agent here in the Raleigh, Wake Forest, North Carolina area. If you haven't yet, please hit the subscribe button, the thumbs up button, and the bell to be notified the moment I have a new video out. Okay, if you're considering a move to the Wake Forest area, you should know that compared to some other areas of Wake County, it can be somewhat slightly more expensive to purchase a new home here in Wake Forest. Currently, the median list price of a brand new detached three-bedroom single-family home in Wake Forest is around $402,000, which equates out to a mortgage payment of around $2,300 per month including taxes and insurance. If you're considering renting here in Wake Forest, the typical three-bedroom residential rental is going to run you around $1,600 per month. So what do you do if you don't want to or you can't afford to buy a new $400,000 home, but you also don't want to basically throw $1,600 per month out the window paying someone else's mortgage? Well, a great option is a brand new affordable townhome in one of Wake Forest's awesome new townhome communities like the Willows at Traditions, which we're about to check out right now. So here we are at the Willows at Traditions. Traditions is a newly developed master plan home community, very centrally located within the town of Wake Forest. If you'd like to see more info on their Traditions community, please check out my video, The Top New Home Communities in Wake Forest. The Willows features three to four bedroom townhomes with finished basements, alley entry, two car garages, and a maintenance free lifestyle. Traditions offers tons of paved walking and bike trails, a huge clubhouse, an incredible saltwater pool, an outdoor fireplace, amphitheater, tons of community events for the entire family. As with the other two townhome communities highlighted in this video, the Willows is located in an incredible location. It's just minutes away from shopping, dining, entertainment options in both downtown Wake Forest and Raleigh. You're also directly next door to the Wake Forest Reservoir where you can enjoy the 1.6 mile walking trail. You can go canoeing, kayaking, paddle boarding on the reservoir itself. Okay, right now I'm here at the Willows at Tradition, standing in front of the Sunrise three-story townhome model. Okay, let's go check it out. One of the nice benefits of living at the Willows at Traditions is the fact that you have no lawn maintenance or exterior maintenance involved with living at the townhome community. For $135 per month, all of your townhome lawn maintenance as well as exterior maintenance is covered. The only other HOA fee involved would be a $225 per quarter Traditions Master HOA due, which includes your amenities and upkeep of common areas. There's also a $450 one-time fee at closing. This particular model runs about $284,000. At the current interest rates, your monthly payment on this particular model would run approximately $1,600. That would include your taxes and insurance. Now, if you're looking for a townhome community with tons of amenities, then I would say you're gonna to need to take a hard look at this neighborhood. There are walking trails, there's hiking, off-trail biking, the Rake Forest Reservoir. Um, there's 100 acres of natural areas. Uh, the club with the swimming pool, uh, salt water swimming pool. There's a playground, picnic pavilion, volleyball courts. You name it, it's here. Okay, on this particular Sunrise model, you'll notice that on the first floor, there's a bonus room. However, there's an option Instead of the bonus room, you can actually have four bedrooms, which makes this model extremely versatile. 
with that particular option, a full bath would go behind this wall. The second stop on our tour of the top three affordable Wake Forest townhome communities is here at Caraway Gardens at Tryon. This community will eventually consist of 51 townhomes. One of the really nice things that I like about Caraway Gardens is the fact that it's located in a really new and upcoming area of Wake Forest. Here you're in an extremely rural, undeveloped area, but again, you're only about 10 to 15 minutes away from major shopping, dining, and entertainment options just down the road in downtown Wake Forest. There's a brand new 100,000 square foot Wegmans grocery store currently under construction about 10 to 15 minutes away at the planned 98 Grove, which is a new shopping and entertainment destination scheduled to be completed in 2021. Okay, right now I'm standing out in front of the Latham model. This is about 1,800 square feet. This particular model is an end unit. You're actually about maybe a five or seven minute walk from the community pool. The Latham model is a farmhouse model. Uh, some of the various features, uh, you've got hardwood style flooring throughout the main living area. Uh, there are wrought iron stair pickets. There's painted and stained cabinets, under cabinet lighting. Well, instead of just talking about it, let's go check it out. The Latham model that we're seeing now runs about $300,000. Basically, your payments on this would run somewhere around $1,680 per month. That would include your taxes and insurance. If you'd like to get pre-qualified to purchase one of these townhomes, please let me know as I have several lenders currently available to help you with this process. I really like the location of this particular community. When I said it's rural, it's really not that far out you're in an area of Wake Forest that's currently undergoing a lot of new construction. There are several new neighborhoods that are going in or in around this particular area at the current time. You're still only just a few minutes, depending on where you're going, you're only a few minutes from most of your retail and shopping options within Wake Forest. To give you some point of reference, from our first stop at the Willows at Traditions townhomes, Caraway Gardens, you're probably only about seven to 10 minutes east of there. The town of Wake Forest is just right around the corner. Uh, again, seven to 10 minutes, literally depending on where you're going in downtown Wake Forest. There's a Target shopping center with quite a few fast food restaurants, full scale, uh, full service restaurants that's that's close nearby another nice benefit of this community is the fact that you're on the east side of Wake Forest which again currently is pretty undeveloped that also is going to give you the benefit of having less of a traffic issue because you're pretty far away from Capitol Boulevard and there's a lot of back roads that you can take living in this area of town The third stop on our tour brings us to the Towns at Gateway Commons. The Towns is a 77 unit townhome development adjacent to the Gateway Commons Shopping Center and the highly ranked Wake Forest Charter Academy, which is just a short five minute or so walk around the other side of the shopping center. This is an absolutely phenomenal location. You're only about a three minute drive into downtown Wake Forest. The factory entertainment complex, uh, it's only about maybe 10 minutes from here. Downtown Raleigh with restaurants, historical landmarks, and other popular attractions is only about 20, 25 minutes away. You could actually throw a rock to the adjacent Lowe's grocery store, or if you don't feel like cooking, you can stroll over the farm and table for a quick bite or a gatehouse tavern for a drink. I'm currently standing outside the first set of townhomes at Gateway Commons that are nearing completion. These townhomes have a very unique design. They're built by McKee Homes, which they're known for their excellent craftsmanship. These homes feature tiered cabinetry, granite countertops, large covered outdoor living areas, decorative lighting, one and two car garage designs, as well as many other amenities. Let's go inside and take a look. Okay, the Towns at Gateway Commons is located basically within a shopping center. The 
Gateway Common Shopping Center is literally right next door. You can actually walk out your door of your town home, walk across the parking lot, and you're in a shopping center. Now, that's going to appeal to some people. It's also going to be a major turnoff to a lot of people. It all depends on your lifestyle, what you're looking for in a home, the amenities that you want near your home, etc. Now, living in this community, you really could probably get away without even having a vehicle because you've got a Lowe's grocery store, like I mentioned earlier, that's literally, you walk across the parking lot and you're at the grocery store. If you want full service dining, you can literally walk across the parking lot and you've got several restaurants literally at your doorstep. On those extremely rare situations where we have snow in North Carolina and basically when it snows here, everything shuts down. But when it snows, this would be the perfect location to be snowed in at because you can walk pretty much everywhere you're not going to run out of food. You're not going to run out of um, things for your home. You've got groceries. Pretty much anything you need is within walking distance. And, and to me, that's the biggest plus of this entire community. As you can obviously figure out based on this video, this was the first townhome that was nearing completion within the community. Another great benefit of living within this community is the fact that you're right next door to several schools, several daycares, there's a high school nearby, elementary schools, literally within 10 minutes of here. If you have any questions about the Raleigh, North Carolina, or the Wake Forest area, make sure you shoot me a text, email, or give me a call at 919-218-7525. I'm a Wake County native and Realtor. I get lots of questions all the time about what it's like to live and buy in the Wake Forest, Raleigh areas. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If so, again, please hit the thumbs up button and give me a like, and please make a comment below. I'll be shooting many more local areas in the future, so let me know in the comments section below if there's a particular area or neighborhood that you'd like me to highlight. Again, I'm Mike Sanders with Mike Sanders Team Realty at Remax United. Thanks again for watching, and remember, get Mike, Get moved.